clowning you at work today, man. So what? I saw the tape. We kept rewinding it. Kind of looked like you were here, but you can't really tell from the back. Are you up? Oh, it's cool. Damn! Put your glasses back on. Welcome to another edition of IMO Sports with Pedro Justice. Well, last night, Steven Nelson stopped DeAndre Ware in the sixth round, and it didn't come without any controversy because, of course, headbutts. That was the theme of last night. He caught a couple of headbutts, clash of heads. He started bleeding profusely, and he had to go to work. So he was like, okay, DeAndre. Okay, DeAndre, you want to go ahead and play around with me? Well, I'm going to go ahead and make quick work of you. So he had to go in there and put them hands on DeAndre. Because DeAndre Ware did not come to play, but neither did Steven so-called Nelson. But that wasn't all that happened last night because his fellow super middleweight boxer, Edgar, Edgar Berlango Jr. said, that boy Steven Nelson don't want no smoke. To which... Steven Nelson replied, first off, address me correctly. I ain't no boy. I'm a grown A man. Go play these internet games with somebody else, especially since every time you see me in person, it's always smiles. What's up, bro? Handshakes and daps. So there's a little beef there. Now, currently, Steven Nelson is the super middleweight NABO super middleweight champion he has a title right now as you see look at these knockouts bow 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 four in a row a unanimous decision two more knockout unanimous decision a knockout so he's been putting in work 14 knockouts to 17 fights pretty impressive the guy challenging him edgar berlango jr he is also someone who has an impressive record he's 14 and 0 with 14 knockouts so I'm pretty sure he's feeling a little cocky right now, and he wanted to come in and try to rain on <laughs> so-called so -called Nelson's parade. So-called Nelson, he is a funny guy. He has a good sense of humor. As you see earlier in the video, you saw a clip of this. I mean, he's a funny guy. He's making light of what happened. He's not trying to blame anything. He's, he just handled business, and that's what he does. So-called Nelson versus Edgar Berlango Jr. I'm up for that. I wouldn't mind seeing that fight. Congratulations to So-called Nelson for the victory. Let me know what you think because the next time is Pedro Justice.